Hurricane Isaac. Many people in Mississippi were affected, and many are still feeling the effects of Isaac, and they need your help. Join us Monday for the American Red Cross Disaster Relief for Isaac Telethon. WLOX has partnered with the American Red Cross to bring you this telethon for the people of Mississippi. Monday during Good Morning Mississippi, Midday, the 4 o'clock show, and WLOX News at 5, 6, and 6.30. The American Red Cross Disaster Relief for Isaac Telethon. We are now just a few minutes away from the start of the WLOX News American Red Cross Disaster Relief for Isaac Telethon. Let's check in with Megan Gray at the phone bank. That's right, Rhonda. We are just moments away from the start of our telethon. Take a look. Our volunteers are standing by ready to take your call. Good morning, folks. We so appreciate them being with us so bright and early on Good Morning Mississippi. Five phones are here. We want all of them to be ringing the number to call, 385-2676. Good morning, Mississippi. This special edition as we prepare to begin our telethon with the American Red Cross Disaster Relief Telethon begins in just moments. We'll be right back. Good evening. Welcome to this special edition of WLOX News at 5. We will, of course, run down all of the day's news headlines for you coming up. But we begin with South Mississippi's recovery from Hurricane Isaac. The storm hit four weeks ago. Some areas saw record flooding, forcing hundreds from their homes into shelters to ride out the storm. Then when they returned home, what did they find? All that damage left behind. Throughout every step, people from the American Red Cross have been there helping our neighbors, whether it was providing shelter to families, offering meals and cleanup kits. The Red Cross is ever present when disaster strikes. And the organization spent millions of dollars helping Isaac's victims, and now they need donations to pay for that effort. You see people there manning the phone lines, taking donations. So the Red Cross will be ready the next time disaster strikes. Today is your chance to help. WLOX News has partnered with the Red Cross, and we have those volunteers there standing by. It looks like some of them are free right now, ready to take your donations. The number again is 228-385-2676. And among the thousands of people helped by the Red Cross, Brenda and Raymond Ross of the Helena community up in Jackson County. Thanks to both of you for joining us today. We Thank you. certainly us. appreciate it. Uh, tell us, uh, Brenda, just a little bit about your story. Of course, there was so much rain from Isaac and the water just was getting higher and higher and higher. Right. Well, <laughs> yeah. Kind of tell us what happened out of your house. Uh, we live on houseboats, so therefore we got totally devastated by the water. It flooded us for a lot of days. Really bad. Boat in, boat out. Houseboats got pretty destroyed. And uh, what, what happened as far as Raymond as the uh, Red Cross goes? Were they there for you to, at every turn to make sure that you were safe during the, the worst of the situation? Yeah, we were able to, um, once the storm was over with, we were able to get hold of them via the phone and they came out and uh, all our vehicles were flooded and we didn't have any way of leaving property. We had been waterbound so long. Uh, they brought us out food for you know, at 12.30 and at 5.30 every day, water, juice, chips, uh, the sea ration meals. Stuff that just kept you going. Yeah, huh? we, just made we, sure no, we were okay. Without them, we had no way of getting anywhere. We were just locked in. Now, Brenda, do you recall ever in that part of South Mississippi seeing the, 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 the water rise that Never. quickly at that N point? No, that was sir. unbelievable. Wasn't that was it? just yeah, unreal. The storm, uh, I, I stayed on the property on the houseboats during the entire storm on the Escatapa River, and uh, it just never, it just wouldn't go away. The, it just like camped on us for Kept three coming days. Coming and coming and coming. Never right. stopped. Never, never stopped. stopped. Well, uh, Godspeed to both of you, and uh, thanks for joining us here on this special edition of WLOX News at 5, okay? And I know both Absolutely. of you are supporting right. the Red Cross. and Totally, our everything that we could do is They were there when done. you need them the most. Please donate. All right. Please donate. Thanks again to Thank both you. of you for being with us. And right now we want to go over to meteorologist uh, Carrie Duncan. Uh, she's in the uh, phone bank uh, area. We have our telephone number, of course, that we're continually running on the bottom of the screen right there, and you can see the folks on the phone bank. Well, we know so many in South Mississippi are still working to recover from Hurricane Isaac. Across the country, the American Red Cross spends an average of more than $360 million preparing and responding to 70,000 disasters like Isaac each and every year. All of the donations made today will help ensure that help is available when the next disaster strikes. Before we leave you here on the special edition of WLOX News at 5, we want to remind you that the phone lines will 
will remain open until 7 o'clock tonight. You see the volunteers in the phone banks, as well as the telephone number right on the bottom of the screen. Karen, what's our total? $370,810, almost $371,000. Thank yeah, you, South Mississippi. Great. And thanks for watching. <laughs>